He's got to leave here in just a little bit, but Luda's hanging out in the studio with me right now. And Luda, if we take back where we just left off, we were talking about the album, and you were saying how you like to do things different. Let's take for a, you know, a couple of seconds here, and let's talk about auto-tune, because everybody seems to be using right now. What do you think? I mean, I don't, I don't really partake in it, but that doesn't mean that... I feel like there are some people that do it, and, you know, I like it, and then there are some people that do it, and I don't like it. But every now and then, it sounds good. I just feel like it was kind of during a specific time period, mm -hmm. and I think that time period is now up. <laughs> so right. while while it was happening for a little while, it was cool. Now it's my, I think it's time to give it up. You know, I was uh, to make a weird comparison. You know, my little niece was saying something over the holidays. She's like, you know what? I don't like the robot sound because I can't sing along to it. Uh, All right, which is until it, she gets in the studio herself and puts somebody <laughs> puts the robot sound on her. But there you of have. Of course, it. and you always make the lyrics in your songs. You know that it's the part that people they scream at the club. <laughs> right. All right. How do you actually do that? I mean, no one really can imitate a ludicrous lyric. Do you still take the standard, what's around me, what happens to me on tour, or do you really sit down, like on your couch, whatever it may be, and just start writing? It's really all of that stuff combined, man. I just like drawing inspiration from a lot of different places. So there's no method to the madness, no one way. I kind of just do it all, man, so that I can get a variety and have a, you know, a good good amount of versatility. All right, now let's talk about the album. All right, dropping next month. Yeah. All right, so tell me a little bit about that, man. Who do we got on this album? Man, on this album, shoot, we got Nicki Minaj, Lil mm -hmm. Kim, Trey Songz, Neo, um, Trina, Eve, just to name a few. I kind of wanted to get an album where you kind of get the male and the female perspective on on. On, on certain records, if you understand what I'm mm -hmm. saying, because a lot of time you hear a song, you just get a man's uh, perspective, or sometimes you just get a woman's perspective. Now you get to hear both sides, kind of going back and forth at each other on on different issues, whether it be relationship stuff, whether it's me having records talking about women, talking to women, and records where women are talking back to me. So it's just a little different, as we say, filling a void. All right, your next single, you know, my chick is bad. <laughs> uh, my chick bad. We got a like a uh, we have a, a, a multi single approach, so that's just one of them. <laughs> right. But if you check the internet you can we just came out with a song today called sexting and you need to check that out and y'all might need to play it because it's kind of a spoof on what's going on with tiger woods and it's crazy <laughs> for all the sexting that's going on not texting but sexting all right so check that out but yeah my chick bad featuring Nicki minaj on the on the remix we got eve trina and diamond so you know it's it's a it's a it's a beautiful thing to work with so many beautiful women period it's rough being luda it's rough as hell man. <laughs> you know what i mean all right so of course that's the latest what's going on with the album now the tour tonight you jumped on this black eyed peas tour very late yeah the last minute and they were like get your show together where we have first show is next week and we we're like damn do you stress about that i mean the big scheme do you stress you're kind of like i'm just going through and do my thing uh, man you know what i don't stress about it because i feel like everything happens for a reason man so I, I roll with the punches it's as simple as that all right now is this the first time ever touring with the black eyed peas this is the first time yeah all right but i'm sure you've obviously run into each other and everything else before oh, yeah. so it's kind of like all right cool good people right right, right, right. man they're having an incredible year and uh you know it's extremely historic what's going on with them so I'm, I'm proud to be a part of it absolutely ludicrous on stage tonight hampton coliseum some tickets still available i know you got to get out of here man yes, yes. Um, all right because they got sound check and stuff like that i know your manager's yelling at me right now all right luda thank you so much look forward to the show tonight thank man. You, man i know you're gonna kill it hampton roads luda is here and he's performing tonight let's go cool <laughs>